Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Last week, Microsoft rolled out Windows 11 build 22581 to dev and beta channel insiders in the Windows 11 insider program. And with that latest update, unfortunately, there is a new issue now, according to recent reports, that is affecting video playback in those latest preview builds of the Windows 11 operating system. Now, according to feedback, apparently videos are opening very slowly after installing this latest update. And uh, part of the problem is that um, videos are not opening immediately and are actually uh, taking a long time to open. And there's quite a delay before the video and movie starts playing. Now, apparently, according to user feedback, the issue is to do with the Windows security app and the Windows Defender app that's built into the uh, Windows 11 operating system. And it's to do with the smart screen component. And apparently, if you disable the smart screen, um, that will resolve the issue as a temporary solution. Now, to do this, we just click on Windows Security. We go to App and Browser Control. And in App and Browser Control, you will see Reputation-Based Protection. If we click on that, it takes you to the Reputation-Based Protection page. And yeah, you see Check Apps and Files which says Microsoft Defender Smart Screen helps protect your device by checking for unrecognized apps and files from the web. Now, this feature is enabled by default as it is a security feature built into the Windows 11 operating system. And to fix that video playback problem, all you have to do is uncheck that and toggle the feature off. And now it's not optimum to actually disable a security feature that's built into the Windows 11 operating system. But until Microsoft acknowledges the issue, which they haven't yet, and rolls out a fix for those preview builds, it's a temporary fix and solution. You can try, um, especially if you are viewing a lot of videos, and to help that video playback resume as normal and until Microsoft rolls out a fix uh, to those preview builds, where you can just come then after the fix and enable that again, and everything should be back to normal. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.